In this video, you will learn about different arithmetic operators available in C++. Let's get started. Arithmetic operators are used to perform different arithmetic operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication, division and modulo division. These are the list of different arithmetic operators available in C++. Plus operator, also known as addition or unary plus, is used to perform addition of variables and constants. For example, 4 plus 2 which will return value 6. Minus operator also known as subtraction or unary minus is used to perform subtraction. For example, 3 minus 2 which will return value 1. Multiplication operator is used to perform multiplication. It is denoted by asterisk. For example, 3 asterisk 2 which will return value 6. Division operator is used to perform division operation. It is denoted by forward slash. For example, 4 slash 2 which will return value 2. Modulo division operator denoted by percent sign is used to find the remainder of division operation. For example, 5 percent 2 will return remainder of 5 divided by 2 that is value 1. Let's understand these operators with help of hands-on example. I have opened Visual Studio code and created a new CPP file. I will declare two int variables and assign some value to them int total equals to 10 followed by semicolon in the next line int count equals to 2 again followed by semicolon i will declare one more variable named result used to store the result of arithmetic operations in the next line i will type int result followed by semicolon let's perform addition operation in order to do that I will make use of plus arithmetic operator. In order to perform addition of total and count, I will go to the next line and type total plus count followed by semicolon. This statement will perform addition of the values stored in total and count that is 10 plus 2 which returns 12. However, we need a way to store the result of this addition operation. I will make use of assignment operator to assign value of total plus count to the variable result. I will go here and type result equal to. In the next line, I will display the value of result using cout. Cout result of addition is result followed by semicolon. Now let's perform subtraction operation. I will make use of minus operator. I will subtract 3 from total and assign the value to variable result. In order to do that, I will type result equals to total minus 3 followed by semicolon. This statement will perform 10 minus 3 and the result 7 will be stored in the variable result. Value of total will not change. It will still remain 10. We are just subtracting 3 from total and storing the result of subtraction in the variable result. I will go to the next line and type C out the result of subtraction is result followed by semicolon. This C out statement will display the most recent value of result that is 7. I will save the program and run it. If you see here, this program returned an error. I made a mistake here. Instead of C out, I typed count. I will simply change this to C out and run the program again. If you see here, the first C out displayed the result of addition that is total plus count and the second c out displayed the result of total minus 3 that is value 7. Let's try one more thing. I will go to the next line and type total equals to total minus 4 followed by semicolon. During the execution of this statement, the program will first perform total minus 4 operation that is 10 minus 4. The result of 10 minus 4 will then be stored in the variable total using equal to assignment operator. After execution, value of the variable total will be updated from 10 to 6. New value will be 6. In the next line, I will type C out value of total after total minus 4 is total followed by semicolon. I will save the program and run it. If you see here, value 6 got displayed. This value of total will continue to remain 6 throughout the program execution. 
until it is assigned a new value or program execution is completed. Now I will try multiplication operation. In order to do that, I will make use of asterisk operator. I will do multiplication of total and count. I will go here and type result equals to total asterisk count followed by semicolon. In the next line, I will type C out result of multiplication is result followed by semicolon. The most recent value of total is 6 and that of count is 2. Here, this statement will perform multiplication of 6 and 2 and store the value 12 in the variable result. This Cout should display 12. I will save and run the program code. The output displayed is as expected. Now, I will demonstrate division operation using division operator. I will try 4 divided by 2. Instead of assigning the value to result, I will directly display the result using Cout statement. In the next line, I will type C out division of 4 by 2 is 4 divided by 2 followed by semicolon. I will run the code. If you see here, this C out statement displayed the result of division operation. Now, I will try modular division operator to get the remainder of the division operation. I will type C out remainder of 5 divided by 2 is 5% 2 followed by semicolon. 5% 2 will perform division of 5 by 2 and will return the remainder value. 5% 2 should return value 1. I will save the code and run it. If you see here, this C out statement correctly displayed the result of modular division operator. If you are finding this video helpful, could you please click on like and subscribe button? Let's summarize what you have learned in this video. Arithmetic operators are used to perform arithmetic operations on operands. If you want to add two numbers, use plus arithmetic operator. For subtraction, you will need to use minus, asterisk for multiplication and forward slash for division operation. If you want to get remainder of division operation, use modulo division operator.